see you in IRS. Good morning, News Flash Nation. I'm Isabel. And I'm Grace. Let's first flash back to Rally 2021 to see who rocked harder. Um, even though it looks a little different, I think it's still going to be a really good and successful rally, and we're making the most of it. Very exciting. Cirque the Seniors. I just learned the dance. We're very, very excited. We're very excited. Um, I'm here with my whole construction crew, just trying to get the job done, get our decorations done. So yeah, we're hoping to at least win something. Yeah, we'll see how it turns out. So this year is our first rally. I'm really excited. Our dance is really good. We really came together this year and I think we're gonna do really good for our first year. I'm excited for the second rally. Um, it's interesting. Our theme is good. Our t-shirt is good. Our dance is good. So hopefully we can pull out a fat dub for the sophomores. Yeah, I think our dance is really good for the first year. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm really excited. We've been working really hard and everyone's putting all of their effort in. I think it's going to be a really good day. Um, I'm really, really glad that we can still do rally this year with COVID. And I feel sorry for the seniors that they can only have one parent, but I'm glad that they can have, you know, parents at all. And I think it's going to be a fun year, even though it's COVID. Um, yeah, I'm really excited for our last rally, and I had a lot of fun this morning um, outside. We're really perfecting our door skills. It only took four years, but we finally figured out as a homeroom how to make a decent door. So and thanks, yeah, Katie Page, for that. Yesterday in the dance, we were, like, practicing, and I'm next to Sarah, and for one part, we, like, go like this, and I, like, flung and, like, hit her arm, and it's in the video, so it's really it's funny. It's not going to happen today. Yeah, I said that's not going to happen today. <laughs> Let's go see the sisters for a spring makeup look. And welcome back to the sister segment, Easter, Easter edition. edition. Today, Catherine will be doing a spring-inspired pastel makeup look on me. So, so grab some sparkling cider and keep on watching. 
So for this springtime look, I'm going to start with some soap brows and then I'm going to fill in Sophia's natural eyebrow shape. I'm now going to take a little bit of blush and put it on some of the high points of Sophia's face. I think this is a nice place to have blush when you have a mask on if you're doing your makeup with a mask on because it's kind of cute. It's like rosy, it's springy. You know, we like it. Now I'm going to start on the eyes and the first thing I'm going to do is take a coral shade and put it in her crease. So a good technique when you're using colors that you really want to pop in your crease is taking a flat packer brush and dipping into the shadow and really packing it in there and then using a blending brush to smooth it out after. All right, so now on the lower lash line, I'm going to repeat the same colors that I had on the upper lash line from inner to outer. Now I'm going to put a white shadow in the inner corner of Sophia's eye before I put the shimmer and that's what makes it pop. Now I'm going to be applying my mascara and then Catherine is going to apply my lashes. Now we're going to finish it off with some setting spray and then come back for the final look. So here's the completed look. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye sisters! Be recreating this nope, nope, not that look. Alrighty. Camera angle, darling. Ugh. You better work. No. I want chocolate lows. Good okay. vibes only. Good vibes only, though. Good vibes only. For real. If you have a bad vibe, you're not. No summer for you. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna marry somebody named Kazoo. We heard from the seniors. We heard from the juniors. And we heard from the sophomores. Now let's go see our feisty freshmen. Meow! I heard Destiny used to eat muffin wrappers. I heard that Maria has a crush on the Ed Puzzle guy from biology. I heard that Mary Elise quarantined five times during the first semester, but was actually faking. I heard Ellie Bendich told Miss Gober she had bad fashion. Ellie Bendich said that I need a new stylist. My sister is dating my ex-boyfriend. I'm dating my sister's ex-boyfriend. I heard Amy and Allie aren't really twins. It's that time again. Question of the week. What's the question, Izzy? Which exam are you most dreading? I think it would have to be the newsflash exam. <gasps> Me too. Let's go see what everyone else had to say. Welcome back to the question. question of the week. What's the question? <laughs> what exam are you dreading the most? Um, I think AP French. Mine's probably AP Physics. <laughs> Apes. <laughs> Geometry. What exam are you dreading the most? English. AP Calculus. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I think either AP Calculus, French, or English. <laughs> Probably Geometry. Like, um, calculus, if Mr. Stevens, if you're seeing this, please help me out. <laughs> <laughs> Geometry. Biology. How do you think your AP Spanish class is going to do on the AP exam? They're going to do great. They've been working all year, so they should be ready. <laughs> Geometry. What exam are you dreading, Isabel? Well, my only exam that I have to take is religion, and I'm really dreading it because I have to go to a Jewish synagogue, and I love Jewish culture a lot, but I'm really nervous to go. <laughs> what exam are you dreading the most? Definitely the AP Lang exam. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on News Flash. Meow. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's a little shaky.